What's up guys, Sean here with Briar Home Buyers again, and today we're gonna to talk about is a direct sale to a professional home buying company the right choice for you in your situation? So, uh, some things to consider. Uh, you don't have to pay commissions. Uh, you don't have any cleanup or repairs. You can close on your terms. You have savings and direct sales create guarantees where listings do not. So the commission part of it is you are not having to pay the 6% commissions as you would if you were to go with a realtor. You also have to pay the agent fees, the listing fees, and the photographer and staging. Uh, you don't have to pay for any of that. Professional home buying companies will buy the property as is. Uh, they don't operate on commissions, fees. Uh, they don't force you to stage the property, get good photographs. Uh, you can basically just walk away. The price that they offer you is the price that you are gonna get for the property. There's no added cost to it. Uh, it's as is. So the second thing is no cleanup or repairs. Uh, if, you're going, if you are going to sell through an agent, most likely you are going to have to make repairs to your property or renovations. Uh, to, I know you're definitely gonna have to make repairs because no matter what or how good your property is, an inspector will come in and will find something wrong with it. That's their job. And the person buying the property sees that as negotiation power and they will come in and try to get as much stuff repaired as possible or they will try to negotiate down the price that you have the property listed for so that they can get it for cheaper. Um, if you have to do renovations to get the property up to market condition so that you can sell the property for market value uh, that other properties are similar to yours are selling for, uh, that renovation costs could range anywhere from 10 to 50 60 thousand dollars depending on how out of date or distressed your property is uh, some people you need to be realistic with yourself about what it takes to get your property to market condition and what those costs are going to come out of your pocket uh, you also don't have to clean up the property uh, when you sell to a professional home buyer uh, if you have a lot of clutter a lot of junk if you've been hoarding for 40 years and you just want to walk away with your uh, most prized possessions, you can take a, a whole room out and you can walk away with that and leave the rest of the house to a professional home buying company. They will handle the removal of all of the other junk and clutter out of that property for you. Uh, you also don't have to keep the property clean uh, because when you stage a property uh, and people are walking through it for open houses and showings, you have to continuously come home from work and clean the property, make sure it's clean, pick up all your stuff uh, just from living in the property. Uh, you have to make sure it looks like a staged property. So you have to constantly keep it clean. And if you're having uh, 40 different showings, you have to come home and clean 40 different times and make sure that's clean. Uh, you also don't have any showings, uh, which could be, I know, I know people who have had to take off work every time there's a showing on their property and that doesn't really help you out any it just costs you money you're not making as much money uh, it's just a real pain in the butt uh, you also don't have to store all of your stuff so if you're staging your property and trying to keep it clean most likely you're going to have to put all of your stuff that's extra into a storage unit or some type of storage i don't know where usually a friend's or family's house or a storage unit uh, you have to store all your stuff somewhere else, pay for that storage. So you have to keep it clean, uh, keep your stuff in storage. You have to do repairs, renovations. It can cost you a lot of money. And those repairs and cleanups, uh, just they're a real hassle to deal with. So uh, the other item is your terms. Uh, you can set your closing date. We can close in as little seven days or up to as long as it takes you uh, that you want to get out of the property. So you can set your closing date when you uh, sell your house to a professional home buyer. So what we'll do is we'll come in, uh, we'll agree to the terms and conditions or the price on the property, and we'll set that closing date for you. Uh, and then what we'll do is if it's two months out, you need two months to get your stuff in order for you to move to the next property that you're gonna be in, or if you wanna relocate, do whatever you need to do, we will give you those two, three months, however long you need, or we can close in as quickly as seven days. Uh, so whichever spectrum of the timeline that you need, we can accommodate that for you and close on your terms. If you sell through an agent, 
uh, you have no idea you're gonna you will be closing on the date that uh, probably not that you want to it's gonna be determined by uh, if somebody is buying the property they want to and when they want to be in that property so uh, we should also try to keep the thing simple the uh, we keep our contract short uh, you don't have to fill out 40 pages of contracts uh, we try to do everything for you we try to handle all the title processes the moving the cleaning out we try to keep everything simple for you so that you can just move on and focus your energy and time on doing what you enjoy doing um, also, if you're dealing with a lot of banks, banks can delay the process for a significant amount of time or they can back out of a property. And if it's in distress or disrepair, they may not even put loans on it. So you have to take all of that into account. Uh, you can close on your terms when you sell with a direct, bu uh, direct buyer, uh, professional home buyer. So, you also have savings. Uh, the longer you own the property, the more it's going to cost you. You have holding costs like mortgage, insurance, taxes, utilities. You have all those costs that you're going to have to take into account. Your storage costs are extra. Uh, that's going to cost you more cleaning, keeping it clean. Uh, all of that stuff is just going to pile up on you, causing you to not make as much money as you would like to make when selling this property. So uh, the last thing is when you sell to a direct home buyer, it's a guarantee sell. Uh, you sign the contract, uh, you have the purchase agreement, you know how much you're getting for your property. You're not just putting it out on the market and hoping that you're gonna get a certain price. You know the price that you're gonna get. Uh, you know the date that you're gonna close on because you will agree to a closing date on that same day that you sign the contract. Uh, versus if you list with the agent, they will inflate the price to get the listing and then they'll have to drop it down a couple months later and send you through a I guess turmoil of emotions trying to sell your property which also adds to your holding cost costing you more money not making you more which is what an agent is supposed to be doing uh, so with us you know your price you know your date you have a guaranteed sell and so that's what a, a uh, professional home buyer can offer you versus an agent and that will help you determine whether a direct sell is right for you and your family. Uh, if you wanna learn more about the process and how we can help you, uh, go to the website, fill out a form on the website, the link will be in the description, or give us a call, and we'll happily answer any questions and tell you everything you need to know and how we can help you through this process. Thank you guys.